Hi, my name is Thomas Kim. Uh, in this session, we will continue from the last session. And in last session, we learned how to make uh, MFC extension DLL. And in this session, we will learn very two, uh, two more concepts that is very important on our development. Say, so open your Windows Explorer, then find the file that you created the solution that we create we created on last session during last session and copy it copy your, your previous session files and rename you the folder uh, it will be O O three, our third session, extension. No, uh, it'll be P P I M P. See, let's let's start. To, to help you understand what it is in the Google search for back to C++ Welcome back to C++ here and in this page we are we are going to p implement this page we are going to use this concept so to understand to better understand the concept of p implementation search for search back to c plus welcome back to c plus plus then open this page and i hope you i hope you refer to this page I will change it P I M P R P I M P R uh, then open it. You don't need this file. So select D S D S D uh, S D F. You also don't need the IPCH file folder, remove it. Then open this copy the file open solution here open it we are going to change solution names this properties and we are going to change it to three uh, p i m p r okay then it is changed Save it, close it, this solution, close it. I closed it. If you come back, this is closed. You don't need this file again. So, now let's open it again. Open the, the solution, this solution. Okay. In the class view, uh, here class view. Open double open it. Open this file. This file. This file and render engine. This is render engine H file here. Uh, protect pri private PLI private in private section class. Uh, mm, what should, let me see class uh, land engine 
P I M P L. I will just say implement IMPL when the engine. Then unique STD unique PTR uh, P land engine. Then MP and the engine. And uh, let me see. We have to add this class. Select, select, right click, add a class. Select C plus plus class. Okay, in the class name field, it should be it should be IM, IMPL render engine. IMPL render engine. Okay, click finish. Here we have to include render engine. Uh, IMPL and then two. I make it go here and uh, private class she and engine friend C and the engine. Then void initialize. I will put it in the private section. Initialize C U P B. Okay. I will make a I will cache, we will can cache it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here. Save it. Copy it. We have to Insert when the engine here. Mm -hmm. See when the engine we have to change change it. Sorry. Field. Okay. Oh, I made a mistake here. I have to change this way. Okay. Let's build a. And <coughs> I have to make some changes to this constructor too. Here. What's the argument? New 
IMPL and engine. Okay. We need to include IMPL rend engine. Okay, let's build it to test whether it's okay or not. Okay. Build again. It seems everything is working fine. Now flash it, flash it out. I will copy and paste from here. I will copy and paste. Okay. Inst uh, instead of doing this, View, preview, I will change it. Okay. Save it. Let's see. Okay, then we change it. MP render engine initialize preview. Okay, let's build. Okay. So everything seems to be working fine. Let's try D2D graphics. Control F5. Let's see. Unique PTR. So we have to include the unique PTR here. Include memory. Okay. Now, control F5. Okay, everything is working fine as previous. We haven't changed anything in D2D graphics MFC application. We haven't changed anything. We only changed the layout of uh, C Lander engine. Say in the Sealand engine, if we see that uh, we made a, a class, we made an instance in the Sealand engine, and we implemented it in different file, in different class, like implement render engine class. See the syntax here. This part, this class will not be exported outside. It will be just used inside lib d2d project and uh, say this is i initialize this this member function is in private section but uh in lender lender engine we can access it we can call it we can call it initialize function lender engine initialize function we re in we redirect actually the reason I'm doing this is to to save our time. Say if we are going to change this C Land engine interface like public functions, every time every each time we change the we change the contents of this file, we have to recompile the D2D graphics. We have to recompile and rebuild D2D graphics. But however if 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 I lay out this way, especially pimp 
pimp implementation like this pimp implementation the concept if we implement class library this way we don't need to compile every each time oh about this i hope you read up uh, you do not you surely read uh, this page this is very important concept okay thank you bye